and security forces have been bracing themselves for just such a massive IRA attack in the wake of Sinn Féin's spectacular political successes in the local government elections last week. The fear was that the IRA, some of whose leaders were said to be unenthusiastic about the ballot box approach, would waste no time in reasserting themselves after a lull in violence in the weeks before the elections. And as if to show that they could strike wherever and whenever they wanted, the Provost chose the busiest stretch of road in the province to mount their attack, the main border checkpoint on the Belfast Dublin Road, just outside Nure. A massive bomb, the Provost said, consisted of a thousand pounds of explosives, was detonated by radio control as an armoured police car was passing by. The police were escorting a security van which had just crossed the border from the Republic, bringing money north to Belfast. Quite simply, the three policemen and one policewoman inside the car didn't stand a chance, with their cortina blown to pieces by the blast. Handicapped children in a school minibus had driven past the bomb just seconds before it exploded. People living in nearby houses also had a lucky escape. Several houses were devastated by the blast.